everyone. This is Stephanie from My Porch Prints, and today we're going to be making this mini book secret cabinet box. This is a um, just secret little box for holding your mini books, and this is from a printable kit in my Etsy shop, My Porch Prints on Etsy, and I'll go ahead and put a link down below to this kit. So let's go ahead and get started. So to begin with, um, we're going to locate the large box. I've cut out all the pieces and printed them. And this one is the large box piece. And what you're going to do, if you like, you can score the lines before folding. That makes it a little bit easier to fold. And then we're gonna go ahead and just fold it and put it together. box is finished and now we're going to go ahead and start folding these three smaller shelf boxes. We finished our three smaller boxes and then we finished our large box and now what we're going to do is take these edge pieces the edges and we're going to fold the tabs and then attach them to our large box to create a finished edge And now we've got the edges finished. If there's a little bit extra, you can trim it up. Okay, so now we have our large box and our three shelf boxes. And the shelf boxes will go inside the larger box. And we're going to set that aside now. And we're going to locate the cover and spine templates. And then we're going to glue these to our front cover piece. So when we do this, we'll want to fit it inside each corner as well as you can. And you want to leave a little more space next to the spine. So the spine will go here. Oops. And then the back cover will go here. And you see there's a little bit of space on either side of the spine template. Okay, so we've glued the cover onto the templates and spine. 
And now we're going to locate the inside cover and glue it inside. And I like to round the corners of mine before I do that. Okay, so now we've glued our inside cover and what we're going to do is just kind of fold it on either side of the spine here. And then we're going to take our bookshelf that we made and just glue it inside this back cover. There you go, you've got your secret bookshelf. And you can fill it with your mini books. All right, everyone, thanks for watching.